can be picky eaters, making dinner pretty difficult for parents. It can be a challenge, I'll, I'll put it that way. Well, a well-known chef now is hoping to inspire parents and educate them on how to create healthier household choices with foods the kids actually like. Fox 10's Danielle Miller has a story. Chef Aaron Chamberlain of Taco Cello has been cooking and feeding people for dozens of years at many of his popular restaurants around the valley. But where his food matters most... You're going to do the eggs, brother. ...is in his own kitchen. His sous chefs, his three sons, six-year-old Arturo, four-year-old Schaefer, and one-year-old Charlie. It's what smells good. What smells so good is this veggie-filled frittata the family is whipping up, doing most of the work, the kids. They each started cooking at one years old. This is my time to spend with them and bond. Um, to me, there's no more value and love than nourishing my children. The children help cook almost every meal to keep them interested and their skills sharp. I have a wide variety of knives. I start with a knife that actually is made from wood. So like Charlie soon will start getting that knife and playing with it. It has no, he couldn't cut them at all. And then I just move them up into their knife. I work with them. I show them knifing skills. When Chef Chamberlain and his wife started having kids, they knew they wanted to enable them to be self-sufficient. I'm so shocked at how many kids right now are so amazing on a computer, but they have no clue how to nurse themselves. And then I see this over and over and over again. So those are the things to me I think it's one of the most important skills you can have is to be able to cook for yourself and to cook for other people. This all may seem a bit overwhelming. Kids not only cooking their own food, but vegetables, no processed foods or sugar included, and they actually enjoy it and even crave it. Chamberlain says this is possible for all families. Start small and setting a plan is the first step. Um, it takes a long time for them to develop a palate. So um, if you give your child, I'm just gonna use broccoli for example, broccoli one time and they don't like it, you have to think that you're gonna have to give that to them over 20 times before they might like it. So what I do is I'm constantly giving them a variety of foods, I'm constantly rotating, and so they actually never get stuck into like this one category. And most importantly, lead, by example. A lot of times what I tell parents is, um, kids watch what you do. So w the best thing you can do is improve your own diet. If you improve your own diet and they're watching you eat broccoli, my wife eats a salad every day. My kids watch that and they just assume we eat a salad every day. You can't separate their food. We never make their food our food. We just make food. Food, Chamberlain says, that will teach lifelong skills and habits for a healthier, happy family. I think at times people make it overcomplicated. It's really not. It is a lot of work. It's planning, it's organization, but I know for a fact it's well worth it and I can see it in my kids every day. Danielle Miller, Fox 10 News. He's right. You got to keep rolling out some of the stuff they don't like. They'll eventually cave in. You just have to be patient. Chef Chamberlain shares all sorts of tips and tricks on his Instagram page and YouTube channel. And we've posted links to all of that on our website, fox10phoenix.com.